When is first day of school? This is Sophia who asked the question during summer vacation. She has been so excited about the start of the school this year 2021. Meet Drew and Sophia. The two of them achieved a new milestone of their lives this year. Drew is now in first year high school and Sophia starts her elementary school as first grader. August 18, 2021, the start and the first day of school here in Norway. This is a big special day for all of us, for my family. But there was something else that I felt that day. I felt emotional. This is a new chapter not only for them, but also in me. They seem so grown up, and flashbacks of moments just rushed in. Drew's first picture with me the day he got to see the world. And here is Sophia. And this is the first time the two of them met. Drew was turning seven that year, when he got a little sweet younger sister. Life has been so fast-paced for me the past five years that I decided to adopt slow living. I want to live more intentionally than before, more consciously. Today was a slow day. Headed to uh, the, the school now. Uh, my mom is driving me. Yeah, I'm actually really excited because you know it's, uh, it's like the final year of elementary school. I'm actually quite excited because I could like finally show my skills, piano skills. Um, uh, to the whole uh, seventh grade. We'll be around.
arriving soon. Um, the school is like right, uh, yeah, those buildings, that's my school. Um, I'm looking forward to this and <laughs> hope I, I don't get something wrong, but even though I get something wrong, no one will like notice it because it's uh, I'm... You're the only one who knows the song, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> You're not going to make a mistake, Anak. I've heard how you practiced, and I think uh, you're doing it uh, perfectly. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> we'll be arriving to like the parking lot now. I'll see you later then. Maybe you can ask Drew. Uh, well, so it's just okay even if I don't have a mask. I have mask, but it's in the car. Of Gang's babies. Uh, wow, it looks like a diploma. He has now graduated elementary years and will be starting high school years by August. So by August, he will be first year high school. But that school is just here nearby. It was something different because uh, we were not allowed to have like a big party like uh, eating together with the parents and other students you know it's uh, all because of this uh, pandemic crisis we still have to follow the protocols when it comes to um, infection control and that is the reason why right after the ceremony and after the recognition and giving of certificates or or diploma we just have to say goodbye and well i wish uh, everyone the best of luck in the next chapter of uh, their education and that will be high school years so drew will be finally starting his first year high school by august so in two months time it will be um interesting and and new something new for him and by that time as well on the month of august a uh, sophia will be starting her elementary years here the same school so what happens now is that drew starts his high school and sophia starts her elementary school It is Kuya Duru's first day as a high schooler. 
So he is already in first year high school and I want to see what's in his bag today. <laughs> okay, this is unnecessary but slippers. Okay. You know, just in case. The one that you will be wearing inside. And there's um, my pencil case. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and and my water bottle and uh, my lunch box. Nice. Yeah. Ah, I see. Okay. What about you, Sofia? And now we will go and raid the bag of Sofia. What's inside the bag of Sofia? It is Sofia's first day in school. She's gonna show us what's in her bag. Wow, that's the this bag is the gift of Uncle Obian. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Record? Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. What's in there? Lunch box. Lunch box. Yogurt. Yogurt. Spoon. Spoon. Okay. Water bottle. Water bottle. Uh, what's that? Can you open it? What? How that will die? Oi, what's going to say, Sophia? Santa Thailand. You can put the teaspoon inside your lunch pack again when you are done eating, okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yay! Are you ready, Anaka? Yes. Ready? Yeah. yeah. Good. And here we go. This was the longest ride I had this day. <laughs> Sophia, first grader, and Kuya, first high schooler. How about you're getting old? I'm 52 already. <laughs> you already have two children that go to school. Drew meets up his class 30 minutes ahead of Sophia's schedule. So I decided to accompany him. But guess what? He doesn't want to. For him, it was unnecessary for me to do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm <laughs> I just want to ask, how do you feel, Anna? Oh my god, I'm all, I already have a, a high schooler. 
Nej, där. Nej, vänt lite. Va? Ja, okej. Okay. He is so independent and does incredibly excellent at school in his elementary years. I know he'll do great here too. I just have to accept that he's not our small tiny baby anymore, but a son who will be entering his teenage years in a few months' time. So after hugging him and waving goodbye, I stopped a while before getting back to the car. Yes, my son is there now. And the day has come that Sophia will start school. It's okay. She says she's a little bit shy. Are you ready, Fia? Okay. Let's go. And now it was time for Sophia to meet up her class. It was time for the roll call of Sophia's class. Nice Fia. <laughs> Come now. Huh? 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 Yeah, the ahar anak. Bito ka magyu una yung tatawag ng kay N A blow. N A tayo siya pat gyu gyu una yung arang kay A B E. I think you're excited, Fia. Fia. And of course, Elisha is also with uh, Ati Fia. That's cool. Ba, ba may de Mateo? Mateo also had. Yeah. <laughs> In two years. Yeah. Two more years before Sophie. Uh, no, Mateo begins uh, school. As first grader, she was the first one to come in front because it was done alphabetically. Sophia held my hand so tight that I could feel how nervous she was. Don't leave me, mom, she kept on saying in a low voice. While we were walking towards the area where school head and teachers stood, Sophia was a little bit scared as everything she saw there except me and us, our family, was new to her. She didn't let me go even if the teachers tried to talk to her. So they allowed me to stay there with Sophia until they walked into the classroom. As much as I was trying to console her, I was also trying to console myself deep within me. But I know that this will be much better eventually. And I promise to have a slow life with the kids during this day and the next years to come. I promise to be a slow parent. Vidu go po barna hagen? Vur for de? Vur for? For the fia are ke dar? Ya. Vidu go po barna hagen? Yo. Nai. Vidu go po barna hagen? Vidu go po barna hagen? Why you're there, eh? Oh, Shana Jumang, you know? Ikisamang, yeah? Where do you find? 
Como are you anymore? Glad are you today? Drew and Sophia, I promise not to overbook you with so many activities. I promise that I will let you take your time to do whatever you enjoy and whatever you love to do. Good. Okay, hada.